Good morning, good morning. So last time we have been busy with uh, the toilet in the bus and uh, today we're gonna continue it. And the only thing we have to do right now is uh, place a double floor. Um, that's for the insulation underneath. Uh, after that we're gonna make the first cabinet for in the kitchen. So what we've done last time I will show you again. This is the toilet like it is right now. There's the floor and that floor is in direct contact with the um, outside world so we're gonna insulate it. No, I cannot speak very good English. Still you make me the count. I felt that my rate in the pickle rate. <laughs> right. Well, you can see we got uh, a lot of great help today. Um, what we've done right now, the bottom is in. We've got insulation in between with a frame around it, and now we can place a plate of wood on top of it. So, you're gonna help? Yes. Good. Yes. Yes, yes. Laat ook wat zeggen. Handkerchief. Handkerchief. Wat is dat dan nu? Ja, zakdoek zeg. Ik zeg zakdoek. Ik zeg zak is sek. Ik zeg en doek is doek. Ik zeg dus dat gewoon sekdoek. En hier ben ik een keer zien. Done. The floor is in. It's quite sturdy if I say so myself. Looking great. There will be a floor over it and. Uh, have to do the outside walls. Yes, you did it very nice. Thank you. Yes, it's very good. I uh, yes. did it uh, the first time without supervision yes. from Herman. I must ever thank the birds. <laughs> Herman had to go away for a while to catch some birds. Yes. And, uh, without oh. supervision. Boop, boop. He did a very nice job. So Super after this, we have to do the no, outside, the poopy outside poopy. walls. I uh, have to put insulation in between. Some simple insulation only for. Noise insulation, if Herman comes to visit us and have to go to the toilet, we need some sound insulation. Mm -hmm. Okay, change of plans. So, uh, as I stated before, we were uh, planning to do the first uh, kitchen part, but um, we decided to do something else because we had to um, move all the insulation around the bus and uh, clear some stuff before we could start to do the kitchen. So we decided to do um, some work in the back side of the bus. Um, we still have some, uh, some walls to finish and um, we have done the framing from the uh, outside wall from the closet. So that's the bedroom for Quinton and there is a closet between here and here so this is the closet and um, we made a frame from the bottom to the top first sheet of wood on it so we have still have to um, cover it all up with OSB but first coffee Just like we did the other side, we have done the wall for uh, the left side of the bus. And we had to make a template for um, this uh, notch over here. So we took the top plate off the right side, made a template for the left side, and it worked. So this side is all the way down done. And this is the inside wall for the bathroom. Alright, that's it for today. Two walls done and we made the floor for the toilet, insulated it. So, uh, going home. Have a weekend. See you guys later. Ciao. Good morning, good morning. Another day and we're gonna continue. Uh, last week I didn't film much, um, but if you look behind me, you can see the result of last week. 
we uh, made all the inside walls for uh, all the walls. Now we have to uh, insulate it and get all the wires through it so we can um, put the inside walls on it, or the outside walls, how you want to call it. Uh, let me show you. So these are the walls for the bedroom of Quinton. We still have to make another wall connected to this. That will be the uh, cabinet pantry. There's a closet. And today we're gonna fix these insulation in between and cover them with uh, some other plywood. It doesn't fit. Alright, as you can see, we're trying to um, put in the first uh, electrical box behind the wall. But um, we got a hole saw, but the hole isn't big enough for the box to fit in. So we have to figure out something else. Hi guys, back again, back at it, another Saturday, and today we're going to continue welding underneath the bus, and also uh, going to prime it, we got um, a paint, uh, we call it Mamie, it's a rust preventive paint for uh, metal, also um, still have to um, do the uh, electric wires for 12 volt from the bus itself, but I don't know if we are going to do that today. So. Alright, that's it for today guys. Thanks to our welding Jedi over here. <laughs> no problem. Um, so we've done the uh, underside of the bus. As you've seen, it's all done on this side. Now we can um, put some wooden sheets on it and um, get all the stuff from inside to down under. And so we can work on the kitchen inside. Um, the only two things we have to weld right now are the first step of the stairs to get in the bus and um, a sheet underneath the driver's seat. There was a plate of wood, uh, but it all rotted away, so um, that's gonna replace. That's gonna be replaced with um, a metal sheet. Um, like I said, that's it for today. Um, hope you liked it, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.